Well, I think it's fairly safe to say now that the nights are going to be dark when heading off for a car camp. normally at this point in the video that you'd be expecting me to be driving to the park up and whilst I had found quite a good location for a Friday night park up that will just have to wait for another day because interestingly the reason why I stopped posting on the community page about when I was going to do a car camp is because of the amount of times where I say that and then I don't go on a car camp now I have quite a lot of intros to car camps that I filmed but I never did because as you might know, I tend to film a little bit on a Thursday night just so I can get out the door faster on a Friday. But because I filmed so much on Thursday night of this intro and I quite liked it, that's why I'm actually doing this video whereas normally you wouldn't have seen any of this but the reason why I didn't go on Friday night was because I've had a bit of a physical ailment that's been playing up this week and to be honest car camping wasn't probably the best thing to do considering so the plan was then to go for a car camp today on Saturday because the advantage of that would mean that it would be daylight and you could see a bit more and I could go to a potentially better location and I did find another one but the problem today is one that you've heard me talking about before and that is of tiredness and I'm just too tired. I'm so tired and the problem is when I'm this tired then A, I'm not going to enjoy the car camp and car camping for me is all about fun and then there's no point filming it because you're just going to see a tired me who can't really be bothered to do anything. So yes, that is why instead you have got me sitting in the fabled garage IKEA chair talking to a camera at 10 past 6 on Saturday evening. But all is not lost because I have two more locations that I know I can car camp at. One if I'm getting there in the evening and one if I have a little bit more daylight. So it's always good to have options for future car camps. But yes, in the meantime, you're gonna to have to wait a little bit longer for the thrilling update on the old heated vest. But plot spoiler, I absolutely love it now. So this video you could say is more behind the scenes that even when it looks like I'm not posting and not doing car camps, you can probably imagine that there's a chance I was gonna go for one, I just never did. This has been a slightly odd, short video, but hopefully the next time you see me will either be a proper car camp or a tutorial. So until next time, take care.